everybody. My name is Olivia. My name is Damien. We are going to talk about praying mantis. This is the praying mantis. At first, we found it at the ice rink. Then, then we found it on the pole, and I thought it was a kind of stick bug. But then I looked really closely. It had a triangle face. So then I said it was a praying mantis. So it was about this big, and now it's this big. So we found a jar downstairs at the basement. This jar. Then we um, we put plants inside, and then we put some aphids because when it's a little tiny baby, it eats aphids. And then we, um, when it grew up a little bit, we started feeding it cricket. But now it doesn't, uh, it doesn't really eat cricket because it's about, um, it's about like a little bit bigger than the praying mantis. So we um, started to feed it crane flies and regular flies, and now they really like the black and white bugs. And this is when um, it shedded the skin. This one was the second that shedded the skin because that's how it turned that big. But the first one, it got eaten by the um, crickets. It has a triangle face. It um it it um tries it camouflages into the um the plant so then when it camouflages it can go grab the bug and eat it. So the the pinchers like the things that help it walk it helps um, also for them to eat. So it goes, grabs the bug, and then it um, holds it really tight, and then it eats it, and then the other bug dies, so then it can eat it. We, we had another um, praying mantis that was called Bella. It um, died, and then it had babies because that's the life cycle of the praying mantis. When it grows up, um, it has babies and it dies. And also, the boy and the girl praying mantis eat each other. They see e each other as food. When it lays the egg, it dies, and then the, praying, the baby praying mantis comes out in the summer, and then, and then we have more praying, baby praying mantis. But we went. But when we went to the park, we saw one. But then it's right in front of my face. Then when Olivia was starting to run in front of it. Then it just ran away. And it's also really good at jumping, grabbing, and catching food. It is also really good at camouflaging because if you put it in our enclosure, it it um, kind of camouflages as a stick, so um, the other bugs can't eat it. Kind kind of like a kind of like a stick bug or a chameleon because the chameleon can camouflage and then one. But it doesn't grab with his tongue because it doesn't have a tongue. And it um, camouflages like a stick bug. Then it um, grabs it really, really fast. And then um, it tries to eat it quick so um, it doesn't run away. It can um, come in many colors. It can... Um, camouflage as a flower but these are really common it um it camouflage as a stick yeah some are really really pretty that camouflages into a flower yeah some could even glow 
The really, really pretty ones are white and pink. It has, um, it camouflages into these really yeah, there's pretty even, flowers. And there's even one pretty mantis that is black and red. But if it grows up into a grown up, it can eat also really small birds too. Yeah. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.